Hi guys. All right. So last video, we learned about the liturgy of the word, the first part of the Eucharist or mass. And, um, we ended with the preparation of gifts. This is the song where or the gifts are being brought up to Jesus. We've collected our offering for him and we're bringing up the bread and wine, which will be blessed and which will become the body and blood of our precious Lord Jesus Christ. So here's a fun song that is sung sometimes for the preparation of that of that of the gifts. So it goes Jesus in the morning, Jesus in the noontime, Jesus when the sun goes down. And then you go praise him, praise him in the morning, praise him in the noontime, praise him when the sun goes down. And then it's love him, love him in the morning, love him in the noontime, love him when the sun goes down, and then it's serve him, and then back to Jesus. So I thought we could take a minute just to kind of sing together. It's been a while, get your voices warmed up and everything. So um, here we go. preparation of our gifts. After the gifts are brought up, we enter into the liturgy of the Eucharist, and this is where the priest is going to be praying over the bread and wine that to become Jesus's body and blood, so that when we go and receive him, we have Jesus in us, and we are nourished to bring him out to the world for this following week till we come back again. So the second half is liturgy of the Eucharist, and this is our celebration of Christ dying and rising and and um, being what we need to sustain us here on earth. All right, so the first thing that happens is the holy holy, and that is, um, you may remember from, uh, this is the big part of the mass, this is the one where we want everybody singing along and really doing their best on this one. Um, <laughs> Savior of the world. And the priest usually will communicate with the musicians which one he wants. All right, I'm going to do letter B when we eat this bread. So the priest will start with the mystery of faith. And we would sing. more words. 
word spoken as as the priest is turning um, the bread and wine into Jesus's body and blood. Then uh, the next musical part is the doxology or the great amen. So the priest would sing the words of through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever. as one body and then the final part of the liturgy of the Eucharist for the congregation before we go to receive Jesus is the Lamb of God This song, the point of a communion hymn is to get everybody um, to be singing along, showing that we are united in this, that we believe we are part of God's family and we are receiving Jesus in the most amazing moment at this time. All right, so this song goes like this. Jesus has given us with those we meet out in the world. And so as we're leaving, we sing one final hymn called the Sending Forth or the Closing Hymn or the Recessional. Um, I like the term Sending Forth because it kind of sounds like, go, take this message into the world. I think it's kind of a, a cool thing to call it. So this song, I'm going, I know you guys know because we did it in music class, so I'd like you to sing along with me for this little light of mine. So there's three verses. We'll do all three. This little light of mine, everywhere I go, and Jesus gave it to me. All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. 